Blitzed, Drugs in Nazi Germany, by Norman Oler is a captivating exploration of the widespread use of drugs during the Nazi regime. Oler delves deep into historical records and personal accounts to shed light on a dark aspect of Nazi history that has long been overshadowed by more well-known atrocities. In this analysis, we will examine the key themes, historical context, and the author's narrative style to understand how Oler presents this controversial topic. Set against the backdrop of World War II, Blitzed uncovers a hidden aspect of Nazi society. Oler's central argument is that drug use was pervasive within the Nazi ranks, from the soldiers on the front lines to high-ranking officials like Adolf Hitler himself. Oler argues that drugs played a crucial role in the war effort and in shaping the decisions made by Nazi leadership. One of the most striking aspects of Oler's narrative is the meticulous research he conducted to support his claims. He draws upon a wide range of sources, including documents from the Nazi regime, personal diaries, and interviews with individuals who lived through that era. This extensive research lends credibility to his arguments and provides readers with a detailed and well-rounded view of the topic. Oler also explores the various types of drugs that were prevalent during Nazi Germany, including pervidin, a methamphetamine, eucatal, an opioid, and cocaine. He discusses how these substances were used to boost the performance of soldiers on the battlefield, increase their endurance, and keep them awake for extended periods. Oler presents compelling evidence that these drugs had a significant impact on the outcomes of battles and the overall war effort. One of the most shocking revelations in the book is the extent to which high-ranking Nazi officials were addicted to drugs. Adolf Hitler himself is portrayed as a regular user of various substances, which may have influenced his decision-making during critical moments of the war. Oler argues that Hitler's erratic behavior and poor judgment can, in part, be attributed to his drug dependency. This perspective challenges the conventional narrative of Hitler as a calculated and rational leader. Throughout Blitzed, Oler also explores the moral implications of drug use within the Nazi regime. He paints a complex picture of individuals who were both perpetrators of heinous crimes and victims of addiction. This moral ambiguity forces readers to grapple with the uncomfortable question of whether drug addiction can serve as a form of absolution for those involved in the Nazi regime. In addition to its historical content, Oler's writing style is engaging and accessible. He weaves together historical accounts, personal anecdotes, and scientific explanations seamlessly, making the book both informative and entertaining. His ability to humanize historical figures and events adds depth to the narrative and allows readers to connect with the characters and their struggles. However, one potential criticism of Blitzed is the lack of a more extensive exploration of the broader societal and cultural factors that contributed to drug use in Nazi Germany. While Oler provides a compelling case for the prevalence of drugs within the Nazi regime, a deeper analysis of the socio-economic and political conditions that enabled this drug culture would have added additional context to the story. In conclusion, Blitzed, Drugs in Nazi Germany, by Norman Oler is a thought-provoking and meticulously researched exploration of a dark and often overlooked aspect of Nazi history. Oler's narrative style, combined with his extensive research, brings to light the role of drugs in the Nazi regime and its impact on individuals and the course of the war. The book challenges traditional views of Hitler and the Nazi leadership, forcing readers to confront the moral complexities of addiction in the midst of one of the darkest periods in history. Blitzed is a compelling read that offers a fresh perspective on a well-trodden historical subject.